Hello my YouTube family, Disciple here for New Gaming, bringing you guys a very, very special video. Uh, this is to thank you guys for the 2,000 subscribers, though I know I am a bit late on this, and I will uh, get into that a bit later. Uh, but uh, this is a video here, to, like I said, thank you guys for all the continued support uh, since I pretty much started Dark Souls, and it, the support has been amazing. So this is uh, for you guys, this is 20 Dark Souls PvP matches, 20 matches. Um, all of different weapons except for one. Uh, there's actually one where I forgot to switch my weapon up So I have uh, two duplicates of one of the matches later on as I get my first win here uh, mainly using the um, Dark uh, occult dark sword plus five, uh, but also I had to uh, switch over to my um, Occult knife because I was getting double teamed and I just wanted to finish it really quick uh I do play a bit cheeky sometimes when there is more than one enemy, but uh, I believe most people understand that, especially since I had to get as many matches as quickly as possible. But like I said, 20, 20 different matches uh, with 20 different weapons except for one of them. One of them is a duplicate, and you guys will notice that later on. Uh, these are all with my new gaming clan armor, so all with zero poise. No healing in any of these matches, not, not one little bit of healing. Uh, my defense isn't that great. I do use a few miracles. Most of the time I focus on the specific weapon though. So yeah, this is um, a really time-consuming video to make. Uh, it took me forever to get all the gameplay. Uh, this is no easy feat. So uh, I don't think I even have to mention you guys and I don't think I even really have to ask for you guys to show your support for this. This took me forever and, I, and I'm sure you guys are already appreciating by me just telling you how much uh, I put into this uh, this video. I'm sure you guys are already appreciating it. As in my second win uh, with the Dark Moon Blade on my Partisan plus 14, 13,000 souls. That guy was a pretty high level. Uh, he seemed pretty noobish still, though. That was kind of surprising. Now, all of these win uh, matches are not wins. Not all of them are wins. Uh, but that's just to keep you guys guessing. Uh, keep it to the variation here, but they all are pretty good matches. And I apologize if some of them are less favorable than others because, uh, you know, I just had to get together what I could. I tried to make them all very good and very entertaining. Uh, so if it is a loss, I guarantee you it would be an entertaining fight nonetheless. Uh, but oof, this took me forever. Uh, several hours of gameplay, several hours of editing, and I haven't even started rendering this. This thing is going to be a monster to render. Uh, half an hour of PvP for you guys. So yeah, that's uh, really special. Uh, hopefully you guys will acknowledge that. And I got this guy with a chain BS because he was flasking. I deem it appropriate to chain BS if someone's flasking. Uh, it's just my opinion. I know a lot of people may disagree with me, and that's that's completely okay. Uh, I, I'm not to say that I'm better, but I, what I believe is the most enjoyable, especially in the kiln, is to be honorable, uh, not flask, and uh, you know, not not jump people. Especially those are the, those are the main things. Uh, not be like this guy either, and attack someone when they're bowing. That was just ridiculous. So you already, you guys already know this guy's not getting any mercy uh, from me here in this fight. But yeah, um, criticize me if you will. Call me, call me stupid for trying to tell people how to play, whatever. Uh, but I believe that it is the most fun uh, when people don't flask, especially in the kill. I don't, I don't care where I am. I don't heal it at all anymore. I used to. I used to be very newbie, and I used to play in some questionable manners. But uh, what I've realized from so much experience with this game, not so much just to criticize people or tell them how to play, is that a, a, an honorable match, a fair fight, is a fun fight. And uh, that's pretty simple. And I, and I know a lot of you guys agree with me. I don't think everybody will, and that's understandable. But uh, if you guys really want to keep this game alive, if you want to keep the fun in Dark Souls, if you want to keep the PvP entertaining for as long as possible, then keep the keep it fun, keep it fair. And, you know, just be respectful to your opponent, show them respect, uh, and don't fight in little, you know, kind of ratty, cheap ways, because it just kind of, it kind of spoils the fun for the game, the fun of the game, in, in my opinion, and I'm sure a lot of people will agree with me, because... If everybody starts playing cheap, everybody starts flasking, and everybody starts healing, then what What? What do we have left? I mean, the game's pretty much just falling apart, and I, I think if it got that way, especially in the kiln and everywhere else, that I would probably just quit. And I know a lot of people don't hear that, and I don't really want to quit either, so, you know, just whenever you can, do what you can to keep this game alive, do what you can to keep this game fun and fair. Uh, any, any chance you get, just like, like this guy, I mean, come on. <sighs> he may not know... And I know some people criticize me on that. Well, maybe he doesn't know that you have all these rules and all that. Well, it, it's not just necessarily rules. It's just like common courtesies to keep it more enjoyable. And if you fight someone who you believe may not know or something like that, just share that with them. Don't be a jerk to them. Like, I, I messaged him. I said, please. I, I asked him. I begged him. 
and I didn't be a jerk. I just informed him. And, you know, some people don't listen. Some people retaliate at you. Some people give you backlash. And I, I, that's understandable. It's not, not everybody uh, has the same opinion about this game. And I understand that. And I'm not going to try to criticize everybody. But I, I am going to punish people who continue to flask. I'm sorry. And I know people, a lot of people are like, well, you don't like backstabbing. You do it all the time. Well, the main thing I, the main issue I had in backstabbing and, the, and the kind of the past to clear this up, because I know a lot of people are going to watch this video that haven't uh, watched a lot of my other videos, is backstab fishing. That's when you deliberately <laughs> go for a backstab right here. But a backstab fishing is when you deliberately go for a backstab when you're fighting an opponent. Instead of just turning to attack them directly, you continue dancing around. And um, I actually did pro straight to this guy right here because I thought he was AFK with a phantom to guard him. So I was just like, ah, I'll get this over with quickly because this isn't. I was thinking this isn't going to be a match that I'm going to record anyway. It's just going to be me killing this guy. So I didn't think I was going to end up recording this. I could have cut that out if I really wanted to be cheeky or whatever. But you know, I went ahead and show you guys that I made a mistake and I actually did message this guy later. Me and him got to talking, and uh, he apologized for having a phantom help him. And uh, he wanted to fight me 1v1, and he actually beat me later, so uh, I'll give him credit for that. He beat me later uh, after we ended up fighting 1v1. But uh, yeah, I prostrated to this guy, I pretty much apologized for backstabbing him, and I let him heal. But yeah, um, the issue I had with backstabbing is just when you're, you, you'll sit there and run around an opponent in circles, instead of trying to attack them, going straight for the back, just trying to end the match. And I didn't think that was very fun. I didn't think, I thought that took away some of the depth of the game. Uh, but that's just my opinion. I don't backstab fish, and uh, sometimes I do go for backstabs when my opponents leave themselves open, uh, just to punish them, get some criticals, uh, do some damage where it's needed. Uh, I'm not completely against backstabs, so please don't criticize me on that, saying that I'm always against it, and then I do it myself, and I'm such a big hypocrite. And I know sometimes I am a hypocrite. Hypocrite. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. I know sometimes I am a hypocrite, and I will criticize people for doing stuff that I do sometimes myself, and I apologize for that. I am human. And I do make mistakes, and uh, I know you guys will forgive me, especially a lot of my return subscribers. Uh, but I'm trying to improve, and uh, I believe this is a this is a really special video. I know uh, this is a, this is, my, my my opinion. This is extreme feat. Twenty different weapons, or well, nineteen different weapons, uh, with zero poise, no healing, no flashing, nothing like that. And then just these uh, not only zero poise, but these these robes that have very not not very much defense, and it's my clan armor. And uh, if you guys don't know, uh, if you guys haven't seen my New Gaming Clan video, uh, if you want to join the New Gaming Clan and pretty much represent my clan that you know that you're, that you're in this clan, that you're playing for me, or you know, you're playing to represent a bigger group of people than yourself, uh, just wear the cleric robes, wear these holy cleric robes, yeah, cleric robes is what they're called. You can get them, I actually have a video on how to get them, it's called New Gaming Clan, or Dark Souls PvP Clan, and you guys can check that out, you can search for that video and find it on my channel and all that, but um, excuse me. Uh, yeah, if you want to join the clan, this is uh, it's it's challenging to win with these. It is, and uh, the the kind of idea behind that is that people join my clan are elite, <laughs> and not to speak for myself, I know, but uh, some people who uh, want to challenge themselves, as I got a first loss right here, uh, can join this clan. Zero poise, decent defense, not great defense, pretty pretty bad, and uh, challenge themselves and win. And I I take uh, subscriber Saturday videos, which is pretty much videos of my subscribers that have they have made, and I upload them on Saturday instead of my own videos. Um, I take those and I take precedence on the new gaming clan members and subscriber Saturday videos. I take those over others uh, because I don't know. I, I just think it's cool. I think it's fun that people are kind of promoting my channel in a way and uh, kind of trying to be part of something. And I feel I, I, I feel special and I feel important. <laughs> and uh, I know I sound kind of cheesy there, but yeah, I do. And um, uh, one more thing. Uh, wow, backstab. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I'm not gonna complain. One more thing I wanted to bring up uh, before I I go on uh, too much of a rant here about my clan is that um, the reason that this video took so long to get out even though I am pretty much at 2100 now is that I was sick for a while and I won't uh, talk too much about it I do have a video on it if you guys wanna uh, look into it on in more detail and find out exactly what was going on with me uh, but I was sick for a while and it was about it was about a week a little over a week uh, I'm not sure exactly how long but uh, it was a, it pretty much a, a sore throat that got out of control and um, I wasn't able to talk or eat and it was really bad for a while but I healed up so that kinda kept me out of uh, commission for a while like not only could I not talk I I was just like sleepy all day and tired and you know the meds were keeping me down and pretty much sedated so I really I, I really wasn't able to do too much as I get an accidental backstab right here that was not on purpose I promise you guys <laughs> uh, but yeah I really wasn't able to do too much so uh, I wasn't able to really work on this video not, not, not nonetheless commentate it and uh, get the parts for it together so that's why this video kind of took so long uh, but yeah now I'm back in full force uh, bringing you guys some more content as much as I possibly can 
and I'm hoping you guys will enjoy this. Uh, I think that I think I did the second fight with my Murakumo. I think there was two of the Murakumo there. That's what I was. I th that's what I think it was. Uh, but now I'm using the uh, Black Knight sword. I, I actually kind of want to point out every weapon I'm using. Uh, I might actually just list them below and possibly link to their stats if you guys want to know the stats of every weapon I'm using. And uh, I'll probably put it at the end. As I'm commentating, it's not at the end, but I'll probably just throw it there at the end somewhere. I'll probably throw the stats of my armor and equipment uh, there for you guys to check out in case you want to. Uh, but yeah, I'll probably I'm not gonna I'm not gonna show stats for all the weapons. That would take another 10 minutes, and that's another hour of rendering. Uh, but I'll probably uh, throw them down below, or at least tell you guys what my uh, weapon lineup was uh, down in the description. If I don't <laughs> backstab, but he was a. Uh, trying to parry me he was going for a parry so I just punched him and I, and I believe that was smart I didn't I didn't really fish for that parry um, out of that backstab sorry I criticized you as, a, as, a, as you will I'm not saying I was completely fair uh, I just say I took advantage of an opportunity that was presented to me and uh, I don't really think it's a big deal especially when I'm fighting it with the disadvantage that I have I'm trying to get as many wins as possible uh, but yeah it was a black knight sword plus five never moving on to the oh the second Murakamo. yeah i knew there was two Murakamos. i don't know why i just forgot to switch it or maybe i just love this weapon so much uh but this what this this fight was actually kind of uh short and sweet a bit iffy and i was kind of playing around with them i never attack anybody while they're bowing i don't care if i've already bowed or they're bowing three times they don't attack them uh but i i, I don't know i just like to mess with people and um i don't know i'm kind of I'm thinking to start a new series called uh, Psych Warfare, pretty much Dark Souls PvP Psych Warfare, uh, where I play pretty much really casually, really smart, really conservatively, and you know, I just let my opponents freak out and dance around. I think it'd be a lot of fun, you know how people sometimes will just run around you and not even attack you, and I'll just stand there still <laughs> and kind of look at them like, what are you doing as I get my return backstab right here? Return to sender. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, but yeah, uh, I didn't go for the chain BS either. I wasn't trying to. I was trying to let him stand up. But yeah, um, I'm thinking about starting a Psych Warfare kind of series where I'm, I'm pretty much really chill and casual in the matches, and uh, I don't know, I try to make my opponent look like a fool. I think that'd be a good idea. Uh, let me know about your guys' feedback. That was my Divine Morocco plus 9 there, though. This is my Lightning Man Serpent Greatsword plus 5, I believe. Uh, this thing does like 640 damage, nothing too great. Uh, but yeah, for all these, I'm also using the Heater Shield. That is my trademark shield, uh, my favorite shield. I believe it's the best, especially for pairing. And yeah, it's uh, super special awesome. <laughs> and uh, quick, s I don't want to get sidetracked too much. Um, quick side note, um, I am starting a new game. And I, I kind of didn't want to talk about this just yet, but I want everybody to know about it. Because I know a lot of people are going to watch this video. Uh, but I just want to inform you guys, it's a public service announcement in a way. <laughs> as I get my parry here. Hope you guys appreciate the sound effects, uh, but yeah. What I, what I was saying is that I am starting a new game. It is I, I believe it's an indie game. But it's published through Konami. It's called Blades of Time, and it just came out the 13th of March. Uh, but not many people have been covering it, so uh, it's kind of something I'm doing pretty solely on YouTube. And I actually made a show playlist. Uh, but yeah, I'm covering it. It's called Blades of Time. It's this really fun kind of hack and slash a bit. And that guy gave me 13,000 souls. That's a lot. He was a much higher level than me. Uh, but it's kind of hack and slash a bit. Uh, I, I know if you guys like Dark Souls, you will enjoy this game. I promise you guys. You guys gotta check it out and you will enjoy it. I promise you. I know almost all my subscribers, I'm begging you though. All, almost all my subscribers I know are subscribed for Dark Souls. And I understand that. And a lot of people are just subscribed for the commentary or the gameplay. They want, especially Dark Souls and only that. But I'm promising you guys, if you guys enjoy my commentary, uh, I keep it lively. And um, if you guys enjoy just my content, you guys will enjoy this uh, playthrough I'm doing at Blades of Time. It's a really cool game. Great graphics, great gameplay, uh, lots of different weapons and combos and uh, things you can switch up and equip. Uh, great graphics, uh, girl main character with uh, with a nice body, <laughs> if you guys wanna wanted to know about that. Uh, but it's really turning out to be a great game, and it was only $40. And uh, kind of the reason I really picked it up was not only because it was $40, and it's only for I know why it's $40, it's like an independent developer that published it through Konami, so, um, whew, nice backstab. Don't flask gonna kill him, please. <laughs> uh, but it was an independent developer, which really uh, doesn't have its name out there very well. So it published it for a lower than average, a lower than average price. So more people would get into the game, and you guys, you guys have to check it out. Just please promise me you'll check it out. You guys will enjoy it. Uh, I keep it really lively, like I said. The commentary is great. The gameplay is amazing. And the reason, like I keep saying, I picked it up was actually because it has PVP. 
Yeah, I know you guys are excited about that. It's another game with PvP, and that's the only reason I picked it up, because I know you guys enjoy PvP so much, uh, it's, it has PvP in it. So I'm actually going to start a PvP series for Blades of Time. But the catch with Blades of Time is that PvP, you have to actually invite people. So, uh, in my first walkthrough, I actually, uh, in the, in the, down in the description, I have my gamer, or not my gamer tag, I keep saying that, I know it's not gamer tag. I have my PSN account name, uh, as I'm using the, um, what, this is the Fire Demon Great Machete plus 9, there's nearly 700 damage in both hands. Uh, but, I, it has PvP, but you have to invite people. So, uh, down in the description of that first video, if you guys check it out, I'll link it below, you guys can add me on PSN if you have the game if you have to have it please don't lie to me and say that you have it and then just add me I want to play with people and PvP them on that game and uh, record it and get some PvP shows going for or some PvP series going for Blades of Time so more of my uh, subscribers can enjoy a different type of game uh, for a similar uh, type of content and you can uh, change your characters up in PvP it's not as customizable as Dark Souls because it's not so much as an RPG it is kind of an RPG it is an RPG but you know not to the extent that Dark Souls is uh, but there is customization and different abilities and spells and specials and all that kinds of stuff. All that good stuff. And I know you guys will enjoy it, but I need some people to play with. So, uh, if you guys will do me a favor and go check out that uh, show. Uh, check out that first episode in the down in the description. And subscribe to that show playlist, uh, which will actually be under the video if you go click on it. Uh, I will be more than happy to add you guys and PvP you and post the videos on my channel. Uh, for a new series and some new content on my channel. Uh, and I, I think you guys will enjoy it. I, I'm pretty sure. I know I will. I haven't got the PvP yet, though, because so, I have no one to play with. So I'm sorry to talk about that so long, but I really do want you guys to uh, get into that and check that out. It w I, I know you guys will enjoy it. I know you will. And uh, it's a lot of fun, and it's going to be a lot, of, a, lot, a lot of similarities to Dark Souls and a lot of differences as well. And uh, just to keep my channel kind of going, uh, give me some more content to do. Give me something else to uh, play. So, yeah, that's what I... Uh, I know I talked about it forever, and you guys are probably kind of upset with me a little bit. <laughs> That's okay, right? You guys are going to forgive me. I just want to uh, get something else started besides Dark Souls, and I am going to con continue doing Dark Souls, of course, but I want to bring something refreshing to my channel uh, besides just that. So yeah, please check that out, guys. Uh, I really will appreciate it, and I know you guys won't regret it, I promise you. So uh, yeah, here I'm using the uh, <laughs> uh, Parry Dagger, uh, Parrying Dagger plus 5, I believe. And I just use Dark Moon Blade. It does like 500, 600 damage. So it's actually pretty monstrous. <laughs> I've only got 2,000 souls there. So I know all these guys, a lot of these guys are varying in levels. Some of them are much higher levels than me. And some of them are, are lower. I don't really know if I can really affect that. It's just a blue eye orb. And I know I am using a Dark Moon Blade in a lot of these. Is I uh, using the Shuttle Plus, mm, Shuttle Plus 10 here, I believe. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I'm using a Dark Moon Blade in a lot of these invasions just because... Um, my weapons, um, I didn't really have time to upgrade them. I didn't want to <laughs> go spend extra time upgrading them, so I just kind of got lazy and cast Darkwing Blade on them. I believe some of my weapons haven't been upgraded at all. <laughs> as, we, as we get down there later, I'll probably mention it. Uh, but this is only a plus 10 shuttle, so I could have made it a lot, a lot more damaging. As this guy cast Iron Flash, that is like the worst thing you can do in PvP. I was trying to see if I had my Lightning Spears, but I don't, so I go for the Great Lord Sword Dance and <laughs> don't get him with it. I almost did, and then he hits me. Or no, he didn't. Gosh, this guy's so slow. I don't know, but um, he's uh, kind of going for flasking and the uh, dark moon, or <laughs> flasking and the uh, iron flash. I don't know. This is kind of funny. Uh, I just had fun with this guy, but yeah, I finished him off with the uh, plus ten sh uh, shuttle. Or no, I finished him off with. No, I didn't finish him yet. But anyway, yeah, this guy was kind of a, a bit of a, a funny situation here that I was in. And just continually kept flasking, so uh, it really wasn't challenging. I just kept punishing him. <laughs> and I go for the chain BS to stop him from flasking once again and finish that fight off. But yeah, uh, a lot of variation in this, uh, which I believe a lot of people will enjoy. This guy was a much higher level than me as well. 11,000 souls, uh, that that fight right there. So yeah, I really I really can't control with the blue eye orb if they're higher or lower or whatever. So it's just a variation of content. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that as well. Some of the fights, the guys are easier. Some of the fights, the guys are harder. Now right here I'm using I think the Wing Speared plus five. Uh, it's just plus five. I was too lazy to <laughs> go upgrade this appropriately, so uh, this thing does like 500, 600 damage. It's not very strong at all, and uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's just good fun, and I pretty much use whatever I thought I could win with, and some of the stuff I it gave me a decent amount of trouble. But uh, this uh, ooh, excuse me, 
the swing speed wasn't too difficult. Uh, but yeah, guys, leave me some feedback on some future content that you're wanting to see, and uh, uh, I'm not going to be doing videos like this very often, <laughs> just because it takes so much time. Uh, but yeah, a lot of stuff has been going on my and uh, in, in my just in my life in general as well, uh, for school and college and stuff like that. So that's also been keeping me a bit busy, uh, aside from my sickness. So I have several excuses here for you guys as to why my content's been so laggy. Uh, but I'm planning to get back to it uh, very soon. Uh, daily uploads. I know I, I've not been too far from that. I've been kind of every other every other day. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna do my best to keep it daily. And uh, this guy right here, I noticed he was going for parries as I was attacking him. So instead of uh, endangering myself and attacking him to a possible parry, I went for the Wrath of the Gods. So that I believe that was a perfect uh, reading of my opponent there. Uh, I don't know what you guys think. I think I read him pretty well and timed it perfectly. My only um, Wrath of the Gods I used that fight. Uh, this commentary is running very long. Uh, this video is going to be very long in general. So, I might run out of things to talk about, but I'm going to try to keep it entertaining as much as possible. Right here, I'm using the server, just plus 5, I think. It does, like, 200 damage without my Dark Moon Blade, so Dark Moon Blade adds, like, 500. And then after my opponent's defense, it's just doing, like, 300 per hit. And I get a backstab. That was backstab fishing right there. You guys I, you guys noticed that. I know you did. He just ran straight to my back. Uh, but I'm not complaining. I, I don't really care. This guy can fight however he wants, because I will fight however I want as well. I don't really need a backstab fish to win, so, yeah. I'm uh, elite like that, <laughs> just uh, too pro for him. But yeah, these fights, a lot of them turn out to be pretty interesting, and uh, you guys have noticed there has been a few losses so far. Ooh, <laughs> that was a mighty backstab. There has been a few losses so far, but I believe they've all been entertaining, whether wins or losses. And I believe some of the losses were actually more entertaining than some of the wins. And uh, I believe someone had actually mentioned before that I should do. Uh, some of my content, whether it's just in one video or just in general, I shouldn't post only wins, so we guys, so people will keep guessing and they won't really know uh, to make it more variate, get, to get more variation to the content, uh, so you guys can't really predict what's going to happen. I believe that's kind of a good idea. So I kind of, it's kind of what I adopted here as my approach, not just because I'm lazy. I know I could have got uh, the few losses that I had. I know I could have got them as wins uh, pretty simply. Uh, I keep saying uh, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to practice on getting better at that. And I, I believe I've gotten better since commentating since my very first video. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I, I'm almost certain that I have. Back then I was uh, extremely bad at this game when I first started. And I was extremely bad at commentating. I just had very little experience. And actually earlier, or last night, actually, um, I, I, I don't know, I just Googled new gaming. I Googled myself. <laughs> I know that sounds dirty. Last night I Googled myself. <laughs> But I actually came across a thread on uh, some website, I think it's just the Dark Souls Wiki, and some people were actually talking about me, <laughs> and uh, someone that actually asked New Gaming Anyone, and <coughs> and uh, the, the guy that had started the thread was like, I personally don't care for him, I think he's very annoying, and blah 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 blah, blah. and it, and to my to their to their defense, I actually, they were talking about an older video uh, where I got a 2v1 and I was all excited about it, that I won, and I was healing back then, and it was just, it was a really old video, it was last year. And um, they were criticizing me for that, and I was I was kind of smiling to myself like that's not even my recent content. I know I was bad back then. I've never denied it. <laughs> I was horrible, and uh, that's not where I got my subscribers from. That's where I got my start, but uh, that's not where I got my subscribers from. I come a long way since uh, that two uh, v one in in Orlando, which I believe has like over ten k views now. I don't know why. It was horrible. Uh, as the lag right here makes me look like I hit him, but I don't get any damage. I staggered him, but he took no takes no damage. Uh, kind of an odd situation. But yeah, I ran into that uh, thread, and a lot of the people were um, kind of, you know, hating on me, and it, it's understandable, and they were like, oh, the worst thing is he has a, he actually has a following, so they were kind of just being hateful, I believe, personally, because, you know, my older content was pretty bad, and I won't deny that, but also because, you know, they, they, they want to do Dark Souls content, too, and they think they're better than me, so they were kind of mad that I had all the subscribers I do, uh, but, you know, haters are going to come and go, it's going to happen, and uh, there's just nothing you can really do about it, so... I don't really care, and uh, actually, uh, what kind of made my afternoon is that as I read on, ooh, nice parry, with no uh, miracle though. <laughs> Still gets 637. But as I read on, there was actually uh, two or three people that defended me, and that kind of made my night. I, it, it put a, it put a bigger smile on my face, not just uh, you know for the haters' sake. That um, one guy had actually said he fought me and um, he beat me, but you know we were talking after he beat me. And he was like, he's a, he actually was a pretty honorable fighter. And I messaged him after, and he seemed like a pretty good guy. I personally have nothing against him. And yeah, it was a, that was actually the last post in the thread, so it kind of made my day. The trolls got um, 
quieted. But yeah, I, I've, I have come a long way, and I know I have. And this is the kind of way to show it. My commentary has gotten a lot better, admittedly. And my gameplay used to be horrible. I'm not even going to lie about that. I, the first video, I didn't even know. I, I didn't really know about Dark Souls. That was I, I played Demon Souls very, very little. Very briefly. And, I, and Demon Souls, when I was doing Demon Souls, I was really just doing a walkthrough for all the bosses and whatnot. I wasn't really doing PvP. I did like five or six matches in PvP total in Demon Souls that I was trying to get into. Uh, there were some more matches that I did, but those weren't, those were just, you know, I wasn't trying to fight. And, um, I really had very little experience. I was, I was admittedly very newbie, and I'm not going to deny that. But it doesn't mean I haven't come a long way. I know I have. And, uh, I've kind of learned from the community that has, uh, you know, given me feedback and told me, well, the, you should really, really do that, or that's kind of newbie, or healing is newbie, and gosh, I got a, I got a backstab on him, I would have finished him. But apparently I got hit at the same time. Oh my gosh, this match just kept me on my edge of my seat. I'm not going to spoil it for you. Oh, that angle. Oh, that was so painful. That was such a good match. It lasted like five or six minutes. And this guy, he, he knew it was a good match too. He bounced several times. Gosh, that was painful. Uh, but yeah, I, I've come a long way. I know I have. And I'm not going to deny that. I used to be horrible. <laughs> I did. But uh, yeah, I've learned from the community. And I've kind of built up around it. And uh, I'm, I'm hoping to educate people as I have, as I have been, because I know I'm, not everybody uh, knows uh, really that there is a community behind Dark Souls and that they like they like fair fights and that keeps it more enjoyable and that flasking really isn't the thing to do. And uh, I'm trying to educate people to that as as often as possible. And it's it's not something easy, but uh, with all with all you guys' help, I'm sure I can do it. And I've gotten this far, and I'm sure we can go farther. And uh, I forgot. Oh, I kind of wanted to give you guys. Uh, since I know a lot of people are going to be watching this video as well, I kind of wanted to give a backstory as to my channel. And uh, I've given this before, but it's been in a video that not a lot of people have watched. It's been in a video that got very few views as, as compared to most of my Dark Souls content. So actually, I wanted to tell you guys. Um, I started New Gaming as a channel that me and my friends were going to do together. And I started it at Bla on Black Ops Commentary. I started doing Black Ops Commentary and gameplays and uh, emblems and whatnot. So it was a, it was a while ago. And it wasn't, it, was, it wasn't meant to be my channel, it was meant to be new gaming, it was meant to be a community channel for me and my friends. And I actually have my own channel, uh, New Disciple, uh, which is me, that, uh, that's why I say Disciple here for new gaming. Uh, but that was my original thing, and the reason uh, of the spelling behind new gaming and uh, new disciple with the K is that I believe that if you're going to be new, if you're going to do something different or new, or you're just different, if you're going to be original, how can you spell something the same way that's always been spelled? And I know it's kind of silly. It was kind of a childish thing. I started when I was like 12 or 13. I don't know. It's been a while. Uh, but yeah, that was kind of my outlook at that. As I went with the scythe plus 10. This weapon looks very fearsome with lightning on it. It looks incredibly fearsome. Uh, I really like it. I wish I kind of I kind of want to use it more often. But yeah, like I was saying, um, I. My personal opinion, as I'm using the Black Knight Great Axe plus 5 on my faith build, this weapon is a mighty beast. Uh, easy to parry though, so I, and I'm not going to use this very often. I just want to try it out. I have to I actually, I, I actually have to two-hand it to swing it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, I'm hoping some guys, some people will get a kick out of this fight. I thought it was pretty funny. Uh, but yeah, uh, that was kind of my uh, look, outlook on that. And if you're going to spell something the same way, it's always been spelled, how is it new? So, I, I, I spelled it differently, and it's really supposed to be, you know, just like new gaming, something new, uh, something different. And a different channel for gaming, a different style. I've always wanted to be an original person. I really don't like to follow in other people's footsteps. That's why I have problems doing uh, walkthroughs when other people have already done the whole thing. If they're not, if it's not some, some something different, if it's not a different type of walkthrough, like a different weapon or a certain requirement to do the walkthrough, uh, then I have problems copying other people. And uh, like with, with Soul Calibur, people would request a character. If someone's already done it, I might try it if I think I could do it better. But uh, I don't really like copying people, and that's just the way I am. I've always been that way, and that's why I don't like wearing full sets of armor. That's why I, I use the new new clan armor. It's just because I'm kind of a stickler for originality, and. <laughs> I know sometimes it's kind of stupid and silly, uh, but you know that's just it's just me, and that's the way I am. And <clears throat> yeah, new gaming kind of like the channel. It started not for me to separate myself. I would have called my name is Josiah, and uh, I don't call myself new gaming or call my channel new gaming to separate myself from you guys or not relate to you guys because you guys are my YouTube family, and I don't want to distance my, distance myself distance myself from you guys. 
So, um, my name is Josiah. I actually talked about that in my uh, vlog. And uh, just new gaming was just meant to me for me and my friends. But now it's solely run by me, completely run by me. I have complete control over it. Uh, and I am partnered, so uh, I've come a long way from when I started, and uh, yeah, it's it's coming, it's turning out nicely. I'm hoping that one day my dreams and aspirations are to make a job out of this. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever get that far. I'm really hoping so because if I ever do make a job out of this, then I can get you guys more content. This can be my day to day. I can uh, have more fun with it, uh, spend more time on it. But yeah, that's uh, hopefully in the near future, not too long. Uh, but I, I am going to be going to college. And I will have the benefit of faster internet, but I will, uh, I'm not sure exactly how much my workload and whatnot will affect my, uh, uploading. Hopefully not too much. I'm hoping that I can still be pretty consistent throughout college. And, you know, this is really my dream besides that, so I'm going to college for game design and development. And that's really my backup plan. This is kind of my, uh, you know, my goal, my dream, but, uh, it's just... That's what it is at this point. It's not something that I know I can rely on for sure. So college will actually be my backup. I know it's kind of funny sounding, but that's the way I'm. But that's the way I'm looking at it. So yeah, uh, we're coming here on the last fight, and this one is not using the clan armor. Let's see if you guys know what this armor is actually from. <laughs> this is actually the armor. This is the setup I used in my very first video. And this is just a homage to that, and this is kind of to show how much I've improved. Uh, this match actually turned out a lot better than I thought it would. This is going to be a really exciting, uh, really expertly played match. And hopefully you guys will enjoy this. But yeah, if you guys haven't already, just let me remind you again, I, I wouldn't ask if, if it wasn't a big deal, but please guys, show your support for this any way possible. Share it, like it, favorite it. I hate asking, I really do, but this took just so long to do. It, guys, it, it would just take you guys a few seconds to do it and help me out. I really, really, really would appreciate it as I get one repost there. This guy's just so predictable, and I get a second. <laughs> oh, please. Uh, show your support for that. That took a lot of time to get this all together. That was expertly played. You guys cannot deny that. I uh, love you guys for your continued support. Please do what you can to help me. Share this video on Twitter, Facebook, everything. I uh, love you guys. Yeah. Ouch, damn it. And God bless. Have a great day. Please help me out. Please, please, please. I'm begging you. And please, please check out the description for my Blades of Time. I know you guys won't regret it. I know you guys will love it. I promise you guys. I promise you. I promise you. Peace. No more treasure? Alright. Oh, crap. Do I want to go this way? Oh. What was that? A ghost? A ghost. It won't be easy to get used to all this stuff. This place seems to be full of curious phenomena. Huh. At least now I can see everything with my own eyes. I've no idea where to start. No treasure. I only know that the legend...